Kevin, you joined Orlando City in 2011, your first pro club. Now you're going to play against that same club for the first time. What's that going to be like for you? First, uh, looking forward to it, you know, as a young kid, just leaving Trinidad and get the opportunity to be a professional in Orlando. They gave me my first opportunity. And it's something that I always say is, is my second home. And I think it will always be because they bring me from home, not, n not being in a professional environment and turn me into a professional, which it was good. And, you know, all uh, from a club coming from nothing to see where they have uh, arrived and, and, and they have been every, every game now, full house and you and all know. We come from non train changing at the side of the, the training pitch and, you know, we didn't even have a locker room at that point in time. And to see how magnificent and how good the, the club has grown and, you know, just happy to see that and just looking forward to the game. It wasn't always glamorous and, and you certainly grew up a lot during your time there. Does that make there any extra nerves or emotions and pressure on your shoulders as you go back and play against your former club for the first time at Orlando City? Oh, I'm, I'm excited to play, you know, um, you know, you know, the trade went on and I'm happy to be here and my focus is here to go there and get three points. And that's the, that's the, main, um, that's the main thing for me, um, work, work in training and, and try to get three points. But no pressure is on me. The pressure is for the team to go and get a result. the first win of the season. And collectively, once we work together as a team, um, we definitely can get three points. You mentioned that trade that brought you here before the beginning of the 2017 season. It was a, a record transfer between MLS clubs at the time. What were your emotions when you first got traded and you were going to be reunited with Adrian Heath? I never, I never get the opportunity to speak about the trade, but uh, I think it's now, it's the time. I, I, I went into the the, tr the training room with Jason Christ and I asked for a trade to move on because I think I have served my time there, you know, and I, it's a club I will always love and I move on here and I'm happy here and I'm, my focus is here and get to reunite with Adrian and them and see this club have billing every year and every year, which is good. And next year, looking forward to being in the um, home stadium. Well, since you're talking about the trade for the first time, was it Minnesota the only option you wanted to go to because of Adrian? No, um, in life, uh, as a sportsman especially, you want to test your character. And um, last year have been a test of character for me to be in a team that I don't know anyone and to come in and, and, and try to uplift the team and help the guys and for them to help me to even get better. Not just me, but for the club to keep growing day in and day out and um, collect every season have been done. This year, you see the club have been growing and getting better and better. And next year, going to be even greater. You talk about a test of character for you and in a way games always seem to be a, a test of character for the teams. How does Minnesota United beat Orlando City? First, uh, collect, we, we can't do it. No individual are not going to win in Orlando. We need each and every one, even the players on the bench, you know, and we show that we have a lot of determination and a lot of character by coming back to uh, the 3-2 in um, San Jose, which was good. But most important, we need to start fast, especially in Orlando. The, the fan base is, is one of the best fan base in, in MLS. You know, it's difficult to play there. So, you know, we have to, to show a tremendous amount of personality, each and every one collectively. And I think we could get three points. We have good qualities. You know, we just have to believe in ourselves more and fight for everything that uh, we want. Because at the end of the day, we are professional. We get paid to win games. You know, we get paid to win games and we need to, to start winning games. You talk about showing your personality and, and scoring goals. If you score a goal against Orlando City, are you going to celebrate? No. I will never. As I said before, that's my second home. I will, I will always love the club. The thing the club have done for me and, you know, I, I really appreciate it. When I was injured for 10 months, they look after me really well. I come from Trinidad and I didn't have my trade. My, I didn't get my release form for two months and they were still paying me and they're still willing to work with me. So I, these are things that remain in the back of my head and, you know, it's a club I love and I will always.